Skitch is an app that allows you to annotate over images. It's a very versatile app that can be used across subject areas. The first thing when you open up Skitch, you'll notice that you can take images from a variety of places. From your photo album, you can take a picture from the camera right within the app, screenshots, images um, from the web, and also they have a built-in map feature with Google Maps where you can take screenshots of any kind of map and annotate over that. Let's take a look at a photograph that I imported in from my camera roll. This is a picture of some students doing a tableau to represent a line. And let me show you some of the, the most common features within Sketch. The first would be the drawing feature. I can choose the color that I want plus the size of the line that I want. And I can click on the line feature and I can annotate over that to show that these students created a line. You can also type in text and with that text let's say I'm going to choose a different color here and I can simply type that in and click done. I can um, use my finger pointer and I can move that wherever I'd like and I can also draw arrows for diagrams to represent things there. If I want to highlight a certain part of this um, of my annotations, I can use the shape feature, and I can click on the shape. Let's say I choose a different color here, and maybe even make the line a little bit smaller. Go back to my shape feature, and let's say I want to say this part of the line is at the top of the line there, and let's say I want to draw special attention, then I can use my shape feature to do that. Let's take a look at some of the ways that we could integrate this within the classroom. One way that we can integrate this is um, by taking pictures of things that happen. Here's a picture of students creating a tableau for the water cycle. And I simply added the words um, of the process in the left-hand corner. Students could use this and they could draw, they could move these around to the correct places um, so they could correctly label this. They could add in their own arrows, their own text, um, their own annotations as well. Another feature that we could use within this is within math. Here's a picture of a, um, I took of a student holding a three-dimensional shape that she had made with straws and twist eyes. She was then able to go back and draw in the vertices and the edges so that she could easily identify those. Students could take pictures of various shapes within their classroom and use the sketch tool to annotate and label the different uh, properties of those shapes. Another great thing about Sketch is simply you're able to take any image. So this is just a picture I took of a 100s chart. And you can see that students could practice counting. They could practice finding the difference between two numbers, um, all annotating over an image that they took from their camera. Another feature that we have is in science. Since Sketch really works well with diagramming, here's a picture that we took of an earthworm that we were studying in class. And so you can see the student um, highlighted some of the things that they noticed, um, even had a wondering that in there. And so science, anything you can take a picture of or a picture from the web, um, this would be a great way to annotate students' thinking. Here is a picture of a map that we use the map feature within Sketch. I took a screenshot of this map and had students annotate the uh, path of Lewis and Clark and Daniel Boone. Last, um, in language arts, this was a picture that I took of a student's poem that he wrote. And then we went back and we used the annotation tool to, to circle all the verbs within his, um, within his poem. Sketch is an extremely versatile tool that students can use to show their thinking across all subject areas.